Hey everyone, I know it's been a while, but I, uh, I'm back to recording Star Trek Online. Uh, this time it's the KDF missions, and our next mission is Second Star to the Right, Straight On Till Morning. Federation Task Force is attacking a starbase we have claimed in, in uh, the El Halana system. I need more ships to defend the base, and your ship is right for the job. Yeah, I'm not, not sure I spelt that system Serve right. Serve the Empire well. Kapla and here's our here's our system so let's go uh let's go enter yeah i kept uh the weather was bad here and we've been get putting up the holiday de decorations around the house so just interruptions after interruptions and then of course every time i try to record the i tried recording yesterday but the uh Actually, no, it was last night I was going to record, but I was way too, just way too tired to record. Then, of course, I was going to record this morning, and they uh, had to update, upgrade the server. Alright, incoming help from the station. Put it on screen now. The Empire's claim to this system are centuries old. But we were forced to surrender this area to the Federation under the Kittimer Accords. That was a mistake, one we now have corrected. Still, the Federation makes a feeble attempt to claim what was never truly theirs. Join us in glory as we defeat Starfleet. With your aid, we can keep the system in the hands of the Klingon Empire. Actually, let's go this way because there is... There are birds of prey here attacking. Okay. Well, so much so much for that. I was going to go over there. I was going to go over there. No, no. Okay. Well, someone did something to my. Someone did something to my shield, and I did not like that too much. I'm not sure what this station is. It looks like the uh, it looks like the Deep K Deep Space K7 station. I think that's what that was called. The one in the Sherman system. I'm not entirely sure what these kind of stations are called, but that's kind of what it reminds me of. Left shield is yeah my port shield. That's swinging around. I hit him with both torpedoes, which is always good. You guys gonna come and you guys gonna come and help me with this uh this ship? Yeah, I guess I guess you are. That torpedo I fired off just kind of, that torpedo I fired off just kind of a, uh, flew off in a different direction. Okay, a Vesper class cruiser. Is that the only one? Where are you guys going? Not sure if the uh, not sure if those other birds of prey are gonna help me, but okay, good. They they followed. They followed. Me. Hit him with the torpedo while his shields are down. That's always good. Kind of weird. I kind of stalled there. I'm not entirely sure if my my engines took damage or not. Fire off that. Boom. 
Oh, what do we have here? And another ship. Wow, that... That wasn't too good there. Course not to not to oh well oh, thank you for the uh, thank you for the tractor boom. Okay, it's a it's a typhon looks like it's a typhon class battleship. Okay, you can stop fire you can stop firing your disruptor beams, it's disabled. The USS De DeWitt is dead in space, sir. Once we are in range, we can begin beaming over boarding parties. If we take her, we can force her captain to give us the command codes to Starfleet Defense Networks. USS DeWitt is completely disabled. Boarding parties are standing by and prepared to transport on your command. Yep, the uh, Delta Rising deal. Captain, Starfleet security teams are active in the ship, and the areas, and this area was clear of enemy life signs. If we cut through engineering and the medical sections of the ship, we should have a fairly direct route to the bridge. I have that, uh, I have that bat lift. Let's switch weapons. <laughs> I'm almost as, uh, I was almost as tall as that door there. Yeah, I see. I see you guys there. Alright. Someone oh yeah, this this guy needs to go because he was flanking me. Can't be having that. Is that it? my map uh, oh okay the doors over here but yeah the uh, it looks like the door the door size had changed because if I remember correctly I think the doors on the ships and stuff were like huge they must have uh, they must have recently changed that maybe Hold on a second. Let me check my map here. I mean, because I see a lot of, uh... Ah. They found us. Starfleet security details are transporting to this location, and they've raised force fields to lock us in engineering. We'll need to deal with both of, the, both of these problems before we can proceed to the bridge. Uh, I'm guessing I need to go through here. Oh, let's not, let's not stand in the torpedo or the torpedo, the grenade area. That would be bad. Alright, we're here at engineering. I'm guessing we're going to need to go up because, oh, no, nope. no, nope, there's a, there's a deal flashing right here. I'll take that. Thank you. The force build is down, sir. We should keep moving and reach the bridge before the Starfleeters tr try something rash, like de depleting the computer banks. There's a turbo lift up ahead. We should be able to take that to the bridge, but we need to act quickly. 
Uh oh, somebody just transported in from the sound of it. Now, where's the turbo lift? Is it. I'm guessing it's up here. Ooh, I'll grab that. Thank you. That guy. They took care of the. Uh, they took care of the rest of them for me. Anything up here? There's an exit, but I'm not entirely sure if this is where I need to go. Yeah, this looks like a. This looks. Whoa. Oh, <laughs> no wonder I did not see that piece of debris there. What? Ah, okay. Yeah, the flashing lights, because of how damaged the ship is, it actually kind of makes it look creepy. Alright. Take that, thank you. You guys attacking something? No, you, uh... Or not. Is this an item I can grab? As a matter of fact, yes it is. Alright, we need to swing through this way. I'm guessing we're, we'll need to go through here. Because that, that uh, exit was blocked off by debris. Yep. Yeah, the guys you want to attack here are guys like a uh, engineers and uh, science officers. The science officers can heal and the engineers of course can lay down uh, the science officers can heal and the engineers can lay down things like turrets and stuff. Okay, whoop. There must be a there must have been enemies in here that I missed. Alright, that takes care of that takes care of them. There's a buttload of there's a buttload of guys there. <laughs> and they, they just, they're just walking around, walking around, being. All right, let's wait for him to come through the door. Hmm. Not entirely sure what my character. Whoa. I said something, but uh, I was, of course, I was distracted by all the enemies that just appeared here. Combat medic needs to go. Alright, that takes care of them. Hold on a second, let me bring let me maximize this a little bit. Ah. This section has been evacuated. And if the Patach were smart, they'd lock down the computers behind them. That means the turbo lifts will be offline too. If we can find an active console, I should be able to bypass the security lockout and reroute power to the turbo lifts. An essential system like environmental controls or an emergency medical console will be our best choice. Best chance. We should look for something like that. Rera reroute power to the turbo lift. Alright. Oh, crap. Alright. Yeah, I like it when they're turned around because I can flank them. 
So basically what we're looking